Jeff, the Hardinge Group have got a lot of products, a lot of quality products under their umbrella. The Kellenberger range of machines is one of them. This is the Kelvista. Where does it sit amongst the other products? Well, Kellenberger and Jones and Shimmer sort of complement each other. Uh, the nature of the Kellenberger constructions, the slides, leads them into different applications from Jones and Shimmer's. Non-round grinding, jig grinding on a cylindrical grinding machine, which is quite impressive, uh, gives customers a lot of flexibility. So if you were looking at cams and stuff like that, is that where this machine would fit? More or less, yeah. They, we would be talking to our customers about machines within the Kellenberger range for that type of work. And you have here, we've got a magnetic chuck on here with uh, what looks like a, a part on, the, on it which you're grinding, but you've got two grinding wheels. Is this a B-axis on this machine as well? Exactly the same. B-axis machine, uh, this is particularly components, a bearing shell, so the ability to grind all of the features on that component in one loading, again, improving accuracy, efficiency. I, I like the fact you've got this magnetic chuck because it's good here, the, the B-axis is turning. Would you be able to do internal diameters or the in, interns of this uh, bearing yes. house? Yes, you would. You'd be able to swing the head from zero degrees to 180 degrees with an internal spindle and grind the bore at the same time. So essentially there, what we're doing is OD and ID in one operation? Exactly, exactly. And, and this, uh, this machine here has got the FANUC control. Is there a lot of emphasis on the software to program things like that, or is it done at the control? Uh, mainly done at the control. It can be programmed offline as well. Slightly different system to the Jones and Shipman suite of software. We are more heavily into the graphic capability for the operator, whereas Kellenberger, again, because of the applications, tend to use a slightly different programming routine. Capacity of this machine, what's it capable of holding and, and uh, grinding? Um, as you can see from the centre height, sort of 300 millimetre diameter components. Uh, Kallenbergers do offer a range of heavy duty heads, higher capacity heads than the standard one, so you're talking a couple of hundred kilos. And, and I know with the Jones and Shipman range of grinders, you're talking sub five microns on your capabilities. Is that even better? Getting better on on there. Not a lot better, but they are getting down there, yeah.